Today's Dope Houston History Spotlight is dedicated to Mr. John Henry, Jack Yates, and the second black high school in Houston that was named after him. Third Ward's finest, Jack Yates High School. Reverend John Henry Jack Yates was one of Houston's most respected and influential religious and community leaders in Houston. His upbringing began in Virginia, where he was born enslaved. By 1960, Jack Yates had made his way to Texas, and after the Civil War, he moved his family to Houston. Not only was Mr. Yates the first pastor of the first black church in Houston, Reverend Jack Yates was an all-around businessman and community leader. He helped develop the Freedman's Town area in Houston with houses, businesses, schools, and churches. One of his most memorable contributions comes with the founding of Emancipation Park. Emancipation Park was the first park in Houston and is the oldest park in Texas. The original purpose of Emancipation Park was to celebrate Juneteenth, hence the namesake of the park, Emancipation, celebrating the emancipating of Black Americans. One of the only parks servicing Black people until the 1940s, Emancipation Park became a community staple outside of the Juneteenth celebrations. Yates Colored High School became the second school for African Americans living in Houston in the year of 1926. The black population tripled between 1924 and 1929 and the community realized that another black school was needed to accommodate the growing community. Jack Yates High School was the education destination for middle and upper class black families. Notable alumni of Jack Yates include Felicia Rashad, Debbie Allen, and Big Mo. It is so big, it felt like you want to, but the water if you want it. My city's so big, it felt like you want to.